Hello guys, um, Nubine Tor here, and we're going to be seeing if buying stuff in Booga Booga is really worth it, or buying private servers. I have one of my own, but, because, well, first of all, if you buy a private server, I'm probably done for buying one. If you play on PC, um, I don't know if there's one for mobile, but you're able to get this app that lets you just automatically go to a page of servers so you can go to a server with like three or two people in it there's i don't think there's ever one you're able to join one with and then plus okay spending money out because yes you can get the game pass for any like like i, I don't know how to describe it new hair and crap i already have that Think of that and stuff, but is that worth it too? I, like, I, I just like it because you can well do all this. You can get these editors, these. But is buying stuff worth it? I mean, you have to be a certain level to get certain stuff you want to get. Like here, you can buy coins for a certain amount of Robux, you can get cosmetics for that amount. Like, the um, Scavenger, and, you know, those. And I don't know if Golden God's very worth it. Unless you grind for it, whatever, I don't care. And then chess. You're able to earn coins also, and you're able to get these way easier with coins. And if you're a nub, I would just recommend going to the floating island, getting gold from there, getting a coin press. So then you can do that. Um, that's why I recommend not buying much stuff for this game. If you're on mobile, you could buy a private server, I don't care. If you're on PC, why do you need one? You can just go to the last server. You know. Well, that's it. See you guys in the next video. I hope you like, subscribe, and enjoy. And comment down below if you think it's worth it buying chess and stuff. Or like, if it's not worth it buying coins. Okay. Peace out. Hey guys, just want to give a shout out to Elite Hell and Check It. It helped me with YouTube so far and have gave me shout outs, so see ya.